Today's weather story will be somewhat brief. Hello everyone, I'm Chief Meteorologist Mike Hurd with an on-demand storm tracker forecast update. You can see there's a ridge sitting across the Pacific Northwest and the jet stream is dropping in from the north northwest and it's allowing for a little disturbance that's sitting up there in southern Canada this afternoon and that could push some minor snow bands down across central Montana including southwest Montana east of the continental divide this evening into tomorrow morning and every time the model updates it shows this to be weakening uh, with every model run so I'm not expecting a lot of significant snow here but there could be some minor snow showers between Butte and Bozeman around 9, 10, 11 o'clock this evening into early tomorrow morning. Should be brief, a quick little shot. This does include Bozeman Pass. There could be some minor snow accumulation. So watch that morning commute tomorrow. There still could be some icy roads, especially at pass level. But then after that, we're settling into a most dry and a milder pattern beginning Friday and continuing throughout the entire weekend. So again, it doesn't show significant snow, but the Little Belt Mountains near White Sulphur Springs, Lewistown, a little better chance for some snow. Maybe a trace to an inch between Bozeman and Big Sky, but Bozeman Pass uh, could be picking up an inch or so of snow, just enough to create some slow go travel tomorrow morning so as you look at the extended forecast starting with Butte a little cooler tomorrow wow look at that upper 30s and lower 40s by Friday Saturday Sunday and then trending colder with the next storm system and a chance for snow Monday into Tuesday of next week for Bozeman again a few flurries overnight tomorrow morning warming up nicely Friday Saturday and Sunday and then a chance for snow and trending colder again by the early half of next week Dillon looks mostly dry holding in that low to mid to upper 30 range through the end of the weekend and then your temperatures will be down into the 20s by Tuesday and Wednesday and West Yellowstone I still think you can get anywhere from 5 to 15 below zero at night over the next two or three evenings with clear skies daytime highs should rebound into the 20s maybe lower 30s by the weekend and then colder highs and lows are back on the agenda by Tuesday and Wednesday